28 pounds, praise the Lord. Let's start. the most glide or groove I've had today. I keep the bar dry where I grip. See how that goes. Praise the Lord. Need to just tighten it up a little bit, but I'm feeling really confident at just dropping under it. I'm really noticing a big difference. Praise the Lord. Good stuff. It's feeling really good. I didn't know it could feel that good. That's feeling really sharp. It's a nice groove. About 122. Good correction. Good correction. All right. Praise the Lord. Good stuff. Like how I saved that last one. I like that a lot. Can happen to meat. Gotta be ready. All right.
Come on. Forced it. That's all right. Got to get comfortable with this too, right? All right. So that's 124.6. Ah, that collar fell off on the last set. Uh, Ivanko. IWF approved bar. So it's 20 kilos. Uh, Hampton Technique plates that are 15 pounds. A couple pairs of York 5 kilos on each side. That was my last set of Steinborn jerks, 124.6, praise the Lord, guess that last recording didn't take, thankfully I haven't moved anything yet, should be 150.9, I'm going to call it 151, Lou Ferrigno 50 pounders on that IWF approved work sand competition bar, 20 kilos, and the Strength Tech collars, added the Specialized Marketing Incorporated quickly collars, just to get this over 150 because it was like 148 and change so i'm like let's just make it 150 so let's see how these steinborn jerks go praise the lord either all right this is 151 it's probably heavier than i quote unquote should go uh it's a big jump but Getting under the bar has never felt this confident, this quick. It's just a matter of controlling, coming up, getting in that right pocket, but dropping under the bar never felt this good. So I'm kind of going with it. But I could see where someone would say, I shouldn't go any heavier. I should maybe harness that a little better. I gotta tell you, I felt pretty ding dang good. Whew, I felt really good. I was kind of thinking more weight would make me get really focused and get it under control. Strength Tech uh, collars, the orange. Outside ones are the SMI quickly collars. And then uh, Lou Frigno 50 pounders. And, uh, old worky IWF approved competition bar. So it's 151. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Good. I'm not freaking out at the bottom. I'm just making the adjustments. Just getting used to being down there in that position. Really happy with that. Maybe that's it. I'll give it one more shot.
think I'm doing anything wrong per se. I just think I've got the power to catch it higher. <laughs> I'm going to do one more set and see what happens. I don't want to go heavier. I guess I could because it would force me down. I just don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Going up to 162, just another five kilos. I don't have to put a bunch on there. I just want enough to maybe push me down, make me get down where I want to be. We'll see. Give it maybe one more try. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Just trying to get some of that wet, loose gravel off there. make a difference well it's better to get rid of it and realize it wasn't there to screw you up rather than finding out the hard way right 162 I like to get under this thing one I wanted and I'm done praise the Lord good stuff really happy with that you're looking at 20 22 pounds more than last time it's not a movement I did very much but still to go up 10 kilos is pretty cool strength tech collars we had our two and a half kilo plates uh, quickly collars are like 1.1 pounds each Blue Freak no 50s. Of course, the work sandbar. Praise the Lord. That's good. It's good for today. Good for today.